first. I am going back to the city immediately. You're going back immediately? Why now? My wife has been at home alone since yesterday. And some of my customers have been calling me that I need to go and see them. Won't you tell Mama before you leave? No. Help me tell her. This is about the... Ten thousand naira. Just take care of my brother. This money won't be enough for us now. We have nothing left in the house, and Mama is now on diet due to her diabetic condition. I better have nothing left with me here. Okay, manage that ten thousand naira for now. What about the money Uncle spent at the hospital? I'm stupid. I just told you I have nothing left with me. What I have here is money I will use to buy fuel when I'm going back. Did I ask Uncle to take Mama to the hospital? Eh? Don't get me angry before I take that money back from you. What is the problem? Go back to your mother. You claim to love me, but you don't. Have I wronged you in any way? Please, let me be. And you see, I was called because there was an emergency. Then I went to the village. I came back. You never cared to ask me how I went. What if it was your mother? Here you go again. Always making reference to my people. Why must you do that? Like I said before, let me be. You know what? You can have this thing to yourself. Wickedness, selfishness, happiness, that's what she gives. No happiness, only sadness, and fallenness. Every day, wickedness, selfishness, and happiness, it's what she gives. By the time I asked after him, Mm. And but I said he had already left for the city without even telling me. Oh, well. You mean his dog left this village without telling you? I said that is the truth. Hey. He didn't tell me. What is wrong with this boy? What is wrong with his dog? Eh? I said that is not even my problem. Whether he tells me or not does not bother me. But my problem, the one that is paining me, is the money you spent in the hospital before he came. He couldn't even drop it for you to have back your money. He gave a very party 10,000 naira, said that was the only thing left on him. I will. Huh. But since then, has he called? Hmm. That's not called. Does uh, it bother about me anymore? Uh oh. Uh, well, <clears throat> it's okay. Let that not bother you. Hmm? Um, if a berry comes back from the market, they had to come to my house. My wife will give her two heads of plantain she caught this morning. Hmm? Thank you. 
thank you. What could I have done without you? Mm. Thank you very much. Uh, let me be going now. Huh? <coughs> but don't forget, tell a belly to come along. Huh? Uh, thank you all. Mm. God, I appreciate you. Thank you. Is she home? No, she's not. She went to see her people. She traveled? Yeah. Without telling me her bestie? Mm -hmm. no, 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 she's that's rude. That's really rude. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, thank you. Can I sit down? Oh, please, forgive me. That's okay. Please sit. That's okay. Um, <clears throat> can I have a glass of water? Okay. Just a minute. Okay, take your time. <sighs> Zorgo, I actually came to see you. You came to see me? Mm -hmm. Um, I really like you. No, in fact, I am in love with you. Your wife, she doesn't. What exactly are you trying to say? What I am trying to tell you is that your wife actually married you because of your material things. Your landed properties, your cars, your houses. I mean, because you are a rich man. Look, I'm not saying you should divorce your wife. I wouldn't, I wouldn't tell you to do that, but... Look, just... I actually want to be that special friend. That friend that would be there when you want her. That would comfort you. You see? <laughs> Get out of my house now. <gasps> Look, if you want me to... Leave my house now. I can strip if you want me to strip. Strip I'm... and leave. I should strip and leave. Strip and get out. Leave my house now. I'm craving for you. I want you to leave my house now. Out. Reminds me, I've not called my friend Lucy for some time now. Okay, let me call her. Hello? Hey girl, what's up? <laughs> How are you? I'm fine, my darling. How are your people? 
They are fine. <laughs> Where are you? What are you still doing here? I'm in my house. Vera, when are you coming back? I don't know yet. I'm not ready to come back to that beast that calls himself my husband. Uh, come on now. Your husband is one who needs you. Needs me? Oh no. He needs his mother. Ah, oh, my dear friend, uh, Iswago loves you so much. He needs you. Ah, uh, sweetheart, I just called to know how you're doing, okay? Take care of yourself. You did well, my darling. I'll speak to you some other time. All right, bye. Bye, friendship. And what's the meaning of that? What's the meaning of what? You heard for yourself, your wife doesn't love you. I mean, I'm, I'm here giving myself to you. Wanting you to accept me, wanting you to take me, like, take me. Leave my house and never come back again. <laughs> I'll come back for you. I'll come back for you. Wickedness, selfishness, happiness. That's what she gives. No happiness, only sadness and fallenness. Every day, wickedness, selfishness. It's what she gives, no happiness, only bitterness, unfollowness, every day. What I am trying to tell you is that your wife actually married you because of your material things, your landed properties, your cars, your houses, I mean, because you're a rich man. I don't know, I don't know yet. yet. I'm not ready, I'm not to, ready come to come back, back to, to that beast that, beast that calls, calls himself, himself my, my husband. husband. I don't know, I don't know yet. yet. I'm not ready, I'm not ready to, come to come back to that, that beast, beast that calls himself, himself. How did you get in here? The door was open. How are you? Good. I'm fine. So right now, my wife is not yet back. So you can start going. I am aware your wife is not back. But I am here to see you. I mean, to be with you, spend some time with you. You're here to see me. Yeah. you see you in the same. You're my wife's friend, for God's sake. Look. It is high time you stopped, okay? Your wife doesn't love you. But you see me? I care about you. I love you so much. I know. But I love her that way. Don't you understand? I want you. I, I, I just want to be... I'm a married man. I don't care. I am good with my wife. Listen, this is an opportunity f to prove to you that I want you, that I want to be with you, that I, I just... Enough of this. Enough. You can use the door now. Can you just listen to me at least? Let me... I need you to understand what Just I'm... use the door now.
Come on, go on. Well, I don't care if he rejects me. But I will never stop. Go on, use the door now. I will never give up. Have that in What are you doing in my house? I, 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 I actually came to see if you returned. Really? Yes, really. You are supposed to call me first. Ah, uh ah. -uh. I called you several, but your, number, your numbers were not going through. Your two phones were not going through. I, I just came and your husband told me that you, you, you haven't returned. I have to leave immediately. Are you doubting me? Whatever. You're supposed to hear from me first before coming to my house. My friend, I am sorry. You know I care about you so much. I wanted to check up on you. I'm so sorry. You can check my phone. I've been... I... Aha! Yes, um, how was your journey, my darling? You have not told me what my friend was doing here in my absence. Talk to me! What do you want me to say? Or rather, what do you want to hear from me? You said you met her outside. So why didn't you ask her what she was doing here? I did, but she lied to me. I knew it and she, she, she observed it. How could you? How could you invite her to our house in my absence? Vera, stop it. Please, just stop it. I don't like it. I didn't invite her. I did not. She said she came to look for you as she told you. Fine. No problem. The truth will come out one day. But if you think you can cheat on me and get away with it, then you have another thing coming. You know I cannot cheat on you. You know it. You know you don't. Don't. Yes, yes, yes. Be fast. I'm, I'm rushing to somewhere. There's something I would like to tell you. I need some money to replace my one at home days. Meaning what? The month just ended three days ago. And I, I, you, 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 you're, you're talking to me about uh, money. Have you not been paid? No, sir. I've not been paying for three months now. What? You've not been paid for three months? Yes, sir. Are you telling me the truth? Yes, sir. How much do you want? Two thousand euro. Thanks, sir. Thank you. I always make sure I give Sarah her salary every month end. So now she's not been paid. I wonder what she's doing with that money. I will find out when I come back.
wickedness, selfishness, happiness. That's what she gives. No happiness, only sadness and fallenness. Every day, wickedness, selfishness, and happiness. It's what she gives. No happiness, only bitterness and fallenness. Every day, heaven knows I try to make it work, but it seems she never cared for me. Happiness is now a history. Tears and sorrow is what she gave to me. Heaven knows. You are not supposed to ask me. I'm supposed to ask you because I've been giving you a salary all this while. It is none of your business if I pay her or not. She is my maid. And this doesn't call for quarrel. Because I've just asked you a question. You shouldn't have. I see. It has gotten to the extent when my maid reports to you, my husband. She didn't report to me. I told you how it started. I see you have money to throw around. Did you seek my opinion before giving her the money for her underwears? You've not told me why you are keeping her three months salary. You've not told me. And I will not tell you. Since you have money to throw around, no problem. Go on. Be giving her money for her underwear, okay? I am yet to find out what is going on between you two. I'm watching you. I will find out. Keep throwing money with me. You've not told me why you're keeping her money up to three months. You still tell me. So you had the nerves. To report me to my husband. I don't understand, Ma. You don't understand. Come on. Ah! <laughs> Who do you take me for? A fool? I did not do anything, Ma. I will slap you again if you say that rubbish. You reported me to my husband. You told him that I have not paid your salary. For three months. Am I right? <laughs> that is not how it happened, Ma. I only ask him money for my underwears. Look who's going You had the effrontery to ask my husband money for your underwear. That's seduction. Oh, you want to seduce my husband? No. With your drive behind? Eh? Look at this idiot. You see that your salary? Say bye bye to it because I will never pay. Tell my husband I said so. You will never get that salary. Now get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Look, look, look at this dry bone. Okay, you want to collect my husband from me? Asking him money for your underwear. Idiot. Come and take the salary. Let me see.
Hello. What? When? How? Oh my God, no, 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 no. no. Can you imagine? He didn't even have the courtesy to tell his wife where he was going to. One, uh, take it easy. It's not the end of the road for you. When there is life, there is hope. This is not the end of the road for you. Hmm? You conquer this one. Okay, B, where do I start from? Where do I go from here? Everything I've worked for, all vanished into air. Oh, I understand how you feel, my lovely brother. But you see, the only thing that doesn't have remedy in this life is death. And you are alive. That means there is hope. Because I'm finished. I'm finished. Yeah, you're not finished, my brother. You're not finished. Don't worry, listen. One may or the other day, you'll be fine. One car, the day Mary, you'll be fine. Don't let it weigh you down. Hmm? Don't let it weigh you down. Get into the car, let's leave here. Hey, Paul, let's go. What is it? Bro, listen. Small challenge. Yeah? It's just small challenge. You'll be fine. See, when you have life, there is hope. Bro. I'm your best friend. I'm always there for you, okay? Don't worry. You'll be fine. Dude, you'll be fine. Get into the car. Let's go, okay? You'll be fine. Taking my calls. He has started again. He has started again. What is it? Let's go inside and talk. No! Well, the truth is, there was a fire outbreak at the market yesterday night. Including your husband's shops were burnt. I don't understand. Wait, wait. You, you... Everything? Nothing was left? Nothing was left. Everything got burned by the fire. Oh my god. Oh my god. <sighs> Come on, it's okay. Even it's the money fire. he hid in the shop, everything burns down. Everything got burned by the fire. <sighs> Come on, listen. It's not the end of the world, okay? Everything will be fine. Right? Just take it easy. You'll be fine.
everything. My darling friend, how are you? How are you? I heard what happened to your husband. I'm really sorry. Why are you looking at me like that? You're not talking. Sorry for what exactly? For what happened? Oh, shh. If you should be sorry for anything, it should be for dating my husband. Oh, you think I don't know? Dating? How would you say? Clean your mouth. Why would you say that kind of thing? You are me? you dating my husband or not, Lucy? Vera, why will you even ask me such a question? How will I be dating your husband, my friend's husband, my best friend's husband? Yes, because you have not explained to me what you are doing in my house in my absence. Ah, my friend, you are my. I wonder what you even you want me to say. I, I'm... The truth, Lucy. What truth? Look, stop it, okay? You are my friend. I will not do that to you. You have to believe me. Why are you doubting me? Tell me the truth. There is nothing to tell. Excuse me. You... What truth? I don't understand. I heard the young man lost his shops. Yes, Dad. Just three days ago, his containers arrived. He spent all he had on them. I don't know what we're going to do. You see? You see? I told him it is not good to put all his eggs in one basket. Exactly. Yes. I advised him to start up a business for you, but he refused. Huh? Mom, I don't know what to do. I don't know how we're going to survive in that house. Our house is going to expire next month. Ah. Hey, <laughs> I wonder why that young man lacks initiative. Chief, I think it is better for you to invite him over and talk some sense into him. Because our daughter will not suffer in his house. So. Right. Yes, Dad, please, invite him over. I will not suffer in that house. I will not. Well... My dear, don't worry. He will invite him over, okay? Meanwhile, let's go to the kitchen so that I'll give you something to eat. Oh, I like the sound of that. <laughs> we'll be right back. All right. Uncle, that is how all I labored for disappeared into thin air. As I'm talking to you right now, I have nothing left with me. To be honest, I'm not happy with you. Okay, let us not go into all that, please. You abandoned your sister and your mother. You are back now, here, because you have a problem. Tell me, what reason do you have to abandon your people? Tell me, your wife and your in-laws are the only people you care about. Is that not wickedness? No, answer me. Is that not wickedness? Uncle, I just told you that I lost my shops and every of my goods in them. And this is all you have to tell me. Would you have visited if not for this tragedy? You did not share your good times with your people. With your family. Now you want to come and share your, 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 your sorrow. That is not fair. It is not fair. Uncle, it's okay. Let's forgive him. Uh, well, uh, it's not that um, I am happy over what happened. But let him accept his faults. And learn his lessons. Uncle, I've heard. I've heard all you said. But please, help me beg Mama. She's still very angry with me. Please.
My friend, please help me. Please. Please, I'm in a big mess now. I need this money. That piece of land is 50 million. I can sell it less than that. Okay, how much do you want to buy it? 10? 10 million? Do you know what you're talking? No, 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 no. 10 million is too small and you know it. So why are you talking like this now? It's okay, I will, I will get back to you tomorrow. Okay. UK, what is it? Say what you want to say, please. I want to go out. So please, I need money to send to Mexico. She has been bothering me for some time now. Were you not paid your monthly salary? I was paid. I just need more for the payments. Please. You came to my husband for what? Darling. Eh, excuse me. So after all my warnings to you the last time, you still have the nerves, the effrontery to approach my husband for assistance. I'm sorry, I, I don't know how to tell you about it. Oh, you didn't know how to tell me about it. But you know how to tell my husband about it. Hi! Hey! UK, enough is enough. I can see that you have started developing hot pants for my husband. Hmm? Vera. You, eh! Vera. Eh, Venom! Allow me, please. You think I'm a fool? You think you can fool me? You think I don't know your moves in this house? Eh? I am watching you. Both of you. As for you, I'll ah. fuck you. Like electricity, man, daughter. I will suck your blood. Oh, that is why you're always coming to me. And I want to buy new bra. I want to buy new pants so that you'll be sampling them for my husband. Vera. Okay? Vera. Eh? Vera. Let me tell you, before you cross this side again, you got that test. I will shock you. I will shock you. You think you can collect my husband from you? If I can. You're too small. Hey! Okay. Out. 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 I am no longer comfortable with you in this house. Mom, Leave! Mom, please. Mom, Get please, out! Please give me time to arrange myself. Arrange yourself? What do you want to arrange? What do you have? What do you come with in this house? You see this uniform you are wearing? I've used it to settle you. Leave. Mom, please, I beg you. Mom, sorry. I don't want to get house with you. Mom, you know my condition. Stop! Out of my house! Get out! Get out! Mom, please. Please. Okay, it's mine. Take him out. Take, take her out of the Push her out of my house. Please. No, 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 I don't have to touch you. Get out of the house. Please. Please. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Get out. Okay. I will suck you. Ah! Come on. Go, go, go. If I see her in this house again by the time I come out, Mom, you will live with her. Mom, please. What are you doing? Come on, get out of this place. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please, how are you? Good, sir. Pass it down. Where is my daughter? She's fine, sir. 
Go ahead and tell me why you are here. Okay, Chief. Um, Chief, please, I, I need your help. Like right now, I have nothing doing at all. And my wife is about to put to bed. I have nothing with me. Please, I need your help. I will pay you back. <laughs> Isog, you know I'm a retiree and I'm sitting all day at home doing nothing. So, how do you want me to help you? Okay. Uh, Chief, um, uh, please, could you help me talk to your son, Obina, who is in abroad? <laughs> Maybe he can send me some money. I, I am going to pay him back. You want me to talk to my son, Obina, to give you some money? So I can start all over again. It's what you me. I'm ashamed of you. Look, look, look at the, the, the kind of lazy bones that identified himself as my in-law. Chief, Chief, why are you talking like this? You're embarrassing me. I should embarrass you the more. You're supposed to be doing something to help yourself. And now you're here telling me you need some money. Look, 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 look. I want you to feel embarrassed so that you can wake up from your slumber. That your shop's got bond is not an excuse for you to go cap in hand begging for money. Chief, thank you, sir. I have to take my leave now. You are working out on me? Come on, will you sit down? I'm telling you something that will be useful for you in your life and you are working out on me. Sorry, sir. Now let me warn you. I don't want my daughter to go hungry in your house. Because if you do, you see the best of me. Livinius, you're a madman. <laughs> Don't you know that I'm a married woman? Yes, I am married. Really? Want to take me out on a date? Mm. Please count me out. Don't count me. <laughs> I'll call you back. I'll call you back. Who are you talking about? It's none of your business. I asked you for money. You didn't give me. But Abru UK, you will give her. Vera, stop that rubbish. Just stop it. I should stop what rubbish. Anyway, for your information, I've sent her out of my house. What? You did what? You heard me. I sent UK, your lover, out of my house. Darling, what is wrong with you? Why are you behaving like this? Why? Please give me the 80,000 that I requested for, for my new week. I should give you 80,000 mm -hmm. When I'm still running around to see how we'll gather some money to go back to my business. And you're here asking me for 80,000 naira for your weaver. You don't have conscience at all. You don't just have conscience. Vera, I will not do it. You will do it. Mamia. Yes. Hey, so because I'm a married woman, I should be looking haggard. Hmm? No! I will look sexy, I will look beautiful like my fellow young girls. You want to go? Hmm? Not be one my wife. You will finish what you started. What is it? Listen, if you don't have money, go and borrow. Failure to do that. This house will not contain both of us. Go and borrow! See what is coming out of your mouth. 
Go and borrow if you don't have, or search it to your car and give me the money. Just see what is coming out from your mouth. What is wrong? What is wrong with you? Wickedness, selfishness, heartless. That's what she gives. No happiness. Only sad. Are you planning to sell the land of the express? Zog, I am talking to you. Yes, I'm planning to sell it so I can add the money to my business. Why were you hiding it from me? What's the meaning of that question? You wanted to sell the land without my knowledge. What kind of a person are you, Zog? You asked if I want to sell the land. I said yes. Is there anything wrong with that? Yes! Everything is wrong with that. I am your wife. If I didn't ask you, would you have told me? I'm supposed to know everything that is going on in your life. Have I wronged you in any way? Oh, please. Spare me that rubbish. Rubbish? Me, talking rubbish. Okay, let me ask you. Since I lost my shots, have you ever asked me how I've been faring or I've been feeding in this house? Why will I ask such a stupid question? And I'm up one. Are you not the man of the house? Vera, change your attitude. It's bad. Why are you treating me this way? I am your husband. Hey, ho. Husband, my left nose. Uh, meanwhile, you've not told me why you chased you here. Why are you bothered about her? Am I? Yes, you are. That's why you keep asking about her. Am I not supposed to know what is happening or what is going on in my home? Well, if you must know. I chased her out because I don't want you to get her pregnant. Vera. Vera what? Eh? Vera what? Ukunaga wangwa. Ananaga va va. Afea. You got that girl? I know all your moves in this house. Vera watched the kind of statement you used before me. Let me tell you, Zogo. I will never be afraid to tell you the truth. Huh? Hmm? I started suspecting you the very day you started giving her money. Mm. Yes. Wait. Are you insinuating that I'm sleeping with her? You know better. Hey. Ma, I quite a girl's school. You know better. You know. Hello? Yes, what is it? Ah, uh ah. -uh. Take it easy now. Calm down. Are we quarreling? What can I do for you? Why are you calling me? Um, can, 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 we, can we talk? Can I have a date with you? Please. Listen, let me tell you something, eh? Stop calling me on phone. Don't ever call me again. Do you understand? I don't want to, I don't want to see your, your call on this phone again. Just leave me, just let me be. Stop calling me. I will not want you again. Who was that? I, look, I, I, I just want us to... Hello? Hello? Ah! Somebody. Person 
You will hurt my baby. You. Lucy. So you are still seeing Lucy? Say Vera. No. <clears throat> Don't call my name. My parents will hear this. Listen. Just, just listen to me, okay? You don't have anything to explain to me. I can to explain. Me. You cannot explain anything. Please, just listen. My parents will hear this. Wait, wait, just listen to me. I'm pregnant. Let me explain. You have the baby. Let me explain to you. And I will help me. I told you to let me go. Oh. You've injured me. Oh, shit. Serves you right. Excuse me. Oh. Vera. Vera. Hello, husband snatcher. You think I will allow you to break my marriage? Very please leave my house. You should be ashamed of yourself. No wonder you always talk ill of my husband. Vera, make use of the door. And if I don't? Hmm? Your plan was to bias my mind and take over my marriage. You should be ashamed of yourself, you shameless shame goat. Vera, I will not have you insult me in my house. Insult you, you said? Are you not shameless? Are you not a husband snatcher? Answer me, you ship! You wanted to slap me. You are not afraid. Try it! You are like a biscuit, idiot. Get out of my house. Now you listen and listen very good. You will not like my action the next time you call my husband on the phone. Shameless she goat. Get out of my house. Shameless she goat. Please leave my house now. Leave my house. Can look at this. What is it? Check it. To what? Hundred and thirty thousand naira. Only. <laughs> I just need this uh, one hundred and thirty thousand naira to buy the first set of baby stays. I'll come back for more money for the second set. <laughs> Vera, you know, this is too much. You know, I just got back to my business. It's too much. How is that my business? You have to give me the money. You just sold your land recently. Are you saying that you cannot squeeze out 130,000 naira to give me for shopping? Your baby's shopping. So because I sold land, no one wants to squander the money just like that. Squander the money because I demanded for ordinary 130,000 naira. Come on. Vera, please try and understand. No, 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 no. There's nothing to understand here. You will give me that money. Else, this house will not contain both of us. What is it? Don't you have human sympathy? Look at the condition you put me into. Anytime I ask you for money, you will still be doing like this, doing what I don't know. Vera, Why are you such down. a stingy man? Calm down. Hey, hey, don't tell me to calm down. You will give me that money. You will give it to me. Huh? has come over her.
Hey, I think that's it. I came to see you. Sorry for keeping you waiting. Hope all is well. No, there's no problem at all. Okay. I came concerning what I told you the last time you came to my uncle's place. Remind me, I've forgotten. I want to learn work. How about your school? I remember you told me your parents write jam. And I think say I do. I need to learn a handbook. It's alright. Um well I collect twenty five thousand to do in my work, but you can bring twenty thousand. Twenty thousand era. What was it? That money is too big for me now, you know. You know we don't have that kind of money. Please, let me give you 15,000 Naira, please. Me? There is nothing I can do. I already removed 5,000 from you. That's why I said you should bring 20,000. Yeah, but please, just because of me, let me give you 15,000. Even the 15,000 Naira, so if I will still have to run around to look for the money. We don't have that kind of money, please. It's still because of you I removed 5,000. Just get some stars on. Back already. What happened? What happened? What is it? Mm -hmm. She said I'll have to pay first. So, how much is she asking for? 20,000. What? That is too much. Where are we going to get that kind of money from? I asked her if she could take 15,000 naira from me. 15 what? That is too much. That is on the high side too. You know we're barely feeding this house. Where are we going to get that money from? I'm tired of saying I do. I need to start up something. I know. But that money is too much. I don't have it. Where will I get it from? Maybe I should go ask Uncle if he could lend me the money. Then when I start up my own, I will give him back. Is it not too much? Food him, money again for expenses him. Is it not too much? Oh, I don't know what else to do. I don't know what else to do. Come, let's go inside. Please help me. Help me, please. Ebele, you came in at the wrong time. I made some expenses this week that left me with nothing in my account. Uncle, please. Please, I beg you. I have nowhere else to go to. Please. Please, Uncle. Even if I can raise 15,000 Naira, I'll go and beg at Tingozi. Please. Excuse me. Okay, I'm for you here. This is five thousand naira. Hmm? Go this one first. 
I will talk to Ngozi hmm? to accept 15,000 naira for you. Huh? Okay. Thank you, Uncle. Thank you very much. Let me stop with you. Thank you. Isuk is the cause of all this thing. Why don't he care for his mother and sister? What is wrong with this look? If it's about that work issue, don't worry yourself. Mama, you will not understand. All my friends are in the university. I'm still at home doing nothing. Like I told you earlier, stop worrying yourself. Everything is going to be all right. I've made up my mind to go visit Brother Iso. He should give me the money else. He will cease to be my brother. Enough is enough, Mama. I have Eberi. kept quiet for so long. Eberi. Two wrongs will never make a right. Take it easy, your brother. I believe he will come around soon. For how long will brother continue to treat us like this? For how long, Mama? It's only when he has problem he will know he has a mother and a sister. Mama. I've kept quiet for so long. No, we should stop visiting this son. Does it mean that my husband is not yet back? I've not seen him. Izogo. Izogo has started again. Are you sure he really went to the market? Because I saw the way he left here. My problem now is that I'm very hungry. Very, very hungry. Maybe you go and drink tea again or while we wait for him. He's all good. He's stepping on my toes. He is stepping on my toes. More tea in the morning. I drink tea in the afternoon. Tea, tea at night. He's stepping on my toes. Oh, Pedro, I'm not going to I will wait for him here until he comes back. I can't drink any tea again. <laughs> 